Series 2's case unboxing mechanics have just been uncovered. We can now see exactly what they're probably going to look like. And in the process, I've also discovered a unique bug that is massively useful, provided you're one of the five or so people on the planet who open cases for a living. Now, this was first revealed by a YouTuber called WaterCS2. It's done via a series of console commands, and if you want them, you won't find them in this video. Instead, you'll have to click the link to his video and go there instead. I am going to show you what they reveal though. So, there are a few different type of containers we can look at. Firstly, we can use it to bring up normal cases. Now, this reveals a pretty normal looking unboxing menu, a bit more attractive than before, but that's about it. You can inspect skins like normal, though you can't cycle through them, and notably, you can also buy keys. This works, you can actually buy keys, and you can do it even if you don't own the case in question. And by the way, there is no limit to how many of any given key you can buy either. Normally, you can only buy a max of 20 at a time, but in CS2, you can just keep on coming back for more and more and more. And if your name is Jesus, Anomaly or Sparkles, this is actually extremely useful when you're setting up for your next degenerate unboxing. But we can also bring up sticker capsules too, in this case, a Cato capsule. Now, these are a bit bugged. It looks like they don't have a proper background and you also can't see an image of the capsule. But on the other hand, you also have an option to open them. And it even works, sort of. Basically, if you hit the big green button, the interface disappears for a bit, and then right at the end, the stickers start rolling in, and then you get this error saying, lol rip bozo. You can get so close to a hollow, and then it all just gets taken away from you. It's basically the honor pixel experience. It's all extremely familiar though. It's a little bit crisper in its design than CSGO, but for better or worse, it looks like Valve isn't going to overhaul things here. But there is one other extremely interesting thing that's been discovered, and this is that you can actually open, inverted commas, collections that shouldn't be openable in this menu, like the St. Mark collection, for example. There's never been a St. Mark container. Now, I would be extremely surprised if this here serves any actual purpose. It's probably possible to load up any collection into the case unboxing interface regardless of whether it has a container or not but for the first time you can kind of sort of open things like the St. Mark or Gods and Monsters collection in game. Again I don't think this is actually intended as content but it is something you can currently do in CS2. I uh, don't get too excited though given you can't actually unbox things your odds of getting a red are zero which admittedly is only marginally worse than your odds of getting an eye of Horus in the first place.